Hey guys, welcome back. Today I'm gonna to be leading you through a 20 minute full body strength workout. So for today's workout, I do have a set of weights. I'm using a set of 10 pound dumbbells, but you can use whatever you have access to at home. And of course, whatever suits your strength levels. The way that today's workout is going to work is we are going to have a four minute warm up that's with no equipment included. We're just gonna do exercises in 30 second intervals and then we'll move on to our sets. We have two sets. We're gonna repeat each set twice. Just make sure that you can see your screen so you can follow along with me. And without further ado, let's get to it. All right guys, so we're first starting off with just some regular jumping jacks out and in. Here we go. Make sure your arms are nice and strong. Shoulder blades down the back. 10 more seconds. Good, step it across and swing those arms. We're just warming up the shoulders, getting the blood pumping. Good, we're gonna shuffle to one side and reach for those toes. Shuffle and toes. Good, next up, warming up the hips. You're gonna draw big half circles with your knees. Get those knees nice and high. Ten more seconds. Good, we're just gonna do some body weight squats next. So feet nice and wide, coming down and up. Make sure you're going all the way down and coming up, but don't swing those hips forward. Down and up, keep the tension on the glutes. Good, staying in that same position with our legs. Fingertips by the ears, you're gonna do some good morning. So, sending those hips backwards, hinging at the hips, and squeezing those glutes. Down and up, down and up. Good, last 30 seconds, skip it out. Good, taking a quick 30 second rest. We're gonna grab our weights, we're moving into our first set. So you only need one dumbbell right now. We're gonna do a reverse lunge. One arm is out to the side. I'm stepping back, weight is in my left hand. My left leg is behind me. Down into a lunge, up, press it into a shoulder press right above the head. Down and up, that's our first movement. Each of these intervals will be 40 seconds on. 20 seconds off, here we go. 
down and up. Press through that supporting heel. Make sure your knee's not going too far over your toes. You're sitting nice back into that lunge, 90 degree angle. Nice work, 20 second rest. Moving on, we're gonna do the other side. And up. I've got my little helper with me today. This is Jazz, my puppy. I don't know if she's in frame anymore, but she decided not to have her nap while we're working out today. Really make sure you're sitting back into that lunge and press through that supporting heel. Nice work, 20 second rest. Let's come down to the ground. So we're gonna do a glute bridge, but first I want you to focus on pressing that lower back into the floor. So lift those hips up, tuck the pelvis under and press that lower back into the floor. Arms come up, you're going to do a lat drop. Down, it doesn't touch the floor, bring it up, glute bridge and down. Hello. Jazz, mommy's trying to work out. Drop the arms and up. Keep it going. Press those hips up as high as you can to the ceiling for those glute bridges. Nice work. All right, we're standing up. <laughs> Next up, you're gonna need both weights now. We're gonna do two deadlifts. So coming down, palms are facing toward you. You're sending those hips back. You're coming up. We're doing two of those. And afterwards, you're going to bring those arms up and do a front raise. Here we go. Two, one, and two. Squeeze those glutes, raise it up. Really make sure you're hinging at the hips, send those hips back, sit into those heels for those deadlifts. Nice work. All right, so that was set number one. And we're going to repeat that set all over once again. So we're gonna start off with doing our lunges with our shoulder press next. Here we go, one side at a time. Down and up, sitting back, press through that heel. Nice, strong arms. Make sure that that hand and arm is coming directly out from your shoulder. Nice work. All right, 20 second rest. We're gonna move on to the other side. Nice 
here we go. Hello. Oops, sorry. Get out of the way, puppy. Nice work. All right, we're coming to the ground. We're doing our glue bridge with our lat raise, or lat drop, sorry. Tuck those hips under, press that lower back to the floor. I want you to hold that position as you're doing the glute bridge. So really sit into those heels and press those hips up. And press that back to the floor. Hold it there as you drop those arms and then press the hips up. Nice work, standing up, getting ready for our deadlifts. So we're doing two deadlifts and then a front raise. When you're doing the front raise, keep those palms facing the floor and keep a slight bend in your elbows. So really sit into the heels here, send those hips back, use those glutes. work. All right, we are moving on to our second and final set. So new exercise. You're starting off in a plank. Hands are on your weights or your dumbbells. You step it into a lunge. Keep that chest nice and lifted as you pull the dumbbells back. Drive those elbows backward for a back row. Down and switch. Nice work. Next step, we're doing a squat. You're gonna hold your dumbbells down, bring it up, hammer curl. Nice and simple. Sitting into those heels, keeping those elbows locked, bringing those arms up and then control on the way down. Here we go. Make sure you don't drop the chest too much as you're coming down into that squat. Keep it nice and lifted, just using those legs. Good, next up, back down to the ground. You are doing a push-up, whether this be on your toes 
or on your knees. Push up, tuck those toes, come into a plank and push back into almost like a down dog or triangle position here. Down to center, down, push up, center and up. Make sure you're hitting those positions nice and solid throughout the whole movement. back up. Whew, this is our last exercise of this set before we repeat it all again. We're gonna do a side lunge. So feet are nice and wide apart. Come down, sit into that heel, come through center, through a hammer curl, and press up above the head, back down, other side. Here we go. Lunge, and up. Again, don't drop the upper body too much. Keep it nice and lifted, nice and strong. Focus on those legs as you're doing those lunges. Nice work. 20 second rest. We're gonna repeat that all again, starting off with our lunge. To back row, when you're doing this, the focus is on keeping the chest lifted. So as you come through here, you don't wanna hold here and just go like this. You wanna lift up so your back is nice and straight and then drive those elbows behind you. You're coming through plank so everything is nice and strong. Core is nice and tight. Up is our squat to hammer curl. Here we go. Nice deep squat. Sit into those heels and up. Nice work, coming to the ground, we're almost there. We're doing our push up to plank to down dog position. Here we go. Body's in a nice straight line the whole time. Make sure you're not arching your back. Keep it nice and flat here as you move through plank. 
Nice work. Last exercise, standing up. We are doing our side lunge, coming all the way through your dumbbells above the head. Don't lock those elbows out at the top. Keep a nice slight bend and control on the way down. Here we go, guys. Last exercise. Let's do it. Come on, guys. Push. Down and up. And that is it guys, great job. All right guys, I hope you enjoyed this quick 20 minute full body strength workout using dumbbells. If you enjoyed this one, make sure to give it a thumbs up and also give my little baby Jazz a shout out. She's the new MadFit mascot. She's here in the studio with me all the time, but she's usually napping when I'm filming my videos. She decided to make a little cameo today. <laughs> Anyways, if you guys are new here, make sure you hit the subscribe button, turn on your post notifications so you don't miss another video from me, and I'll see you guys very soon. Bye. Say bye. Bye. <laughs>